question is making it easier for new businesses to move or start in Chatham County a proper use of taxpayer funds. Start with Mr. Cross. I assume that's referring to our incentive program, which is based upon a tax credit for the number of jobs that you bring in and the number of money, amount of money that you invest in your company. Uh, and it's all relative. If you, if, if you are granted a, uh, money for either of those or both of those, it is, it is, uh, you still pay it in until you prove that you have produced the jobs and made the investment that you claim that you would have, and then you're given that credit off your taxes. So it's not a matter of that we gave any money away, we just didn't collect some because you brought an investment to the county. Uh, that's, that's my understanding of the program. We're, we're, we're back funding the companies, not uh, uh, giving money on the front end. Because basically we can say prove yourself to us and uh, if you prove yourself to us then we're willing to go ahead and give you the incentives. Well actually the reason we don't get to them on the front end is that's against the law. Okay. In North Carolina you cannot give mm -hmm. someone a tax break. So that's why it's structured the way that it is. Um, not only do we have a, a really good incentives policy that was developed under, under the prior board and it was being modeled all across the state, we also have the Small Business Center here at the Community College, which provides support for small businesses. And then for people who are looking for employment, um, a couple of years ago we were able to have the Job Link Center here. Um, so I do, you know, unfortunately the concept of incentives is not one that that I particularly like, but it is one that if we're going to be competitive in this environment where everyone else is doing it, it's kind of like the lottery. We jumped in. Um, so I do say that um, the citizen policy that we do have here in Chatham really is structured in such a way that I think it's a, it's a really good program. What Sally said about competing with the areas around you is valid. Um, you have to play by the rules that everybody else plays by if you're going to compete and attract businesses to the county. And attracting businesses to the county is the way to expand the economy, which is, again, the horse before the cart, and that's what you have to do. So I don't have a problem with this. Any more bottles? 